This video is sponsored by EA. Hey guys, this is Billy Eat Worlds, and in this video, I want to show you guys some tips on how to shoot guns effectively in Battlefield 5. Now, the first thing you need to know about gunplay in BF5 is that there's seven different weapon categories, each with their own strengths and weaknesses. The bolt actions and self-loading rifles are best suited for longer ranges, assault rifles and machine guns are best at mid-range, and submachine guns, shotguns and sidearms are excellent at close range. Also, you'll notice if you take a look at the stats for each weapon in-game, there's three different fire modes, single shot, semi-automatic and fully automatic. And some weapons, like a lot of the assault rifles for example, are called select fire weapons, meaning that you can change the fire mode in-game depending on the type of engagement you find yourself in. This is really useful because Battlefield 5 also features a recoil mechanic which makes things even more challenging. This is when your weapon's barrel moves up and sometimes side to side when you open fire and this will cause you to miss your target if you don't take control. You can counter recoil simply by moving your mouse or your aiming joystick in the opposite direction to your weapon's recoil pattern. And as every weapon in game has its own unique pattern, that means with a little practice in no time at all, you'll be able to learn and memorize the recoil of your favorite guns. Another fundamental feature of Battlefield 5's gunplay is the aim down sights mechanic, which you can access by hitting the right mouse button or left trigger on console. This allows you to use the sight or scope on your weapon, and it also focuses your weapon's accuracy, which is essential if you want to hit targets at mid to long range. The downside of ADS, though, is that it does take a fraction of a second to activate, and to some degree, your sight or scope will obscure your field of view. And so sometimes, at point-blank range, it's actually more effective to not use ADS, which is a much less accurate but faster aiming technique called hipfire. Using ADS, especially with long-range weapons like the bolt-action rifles, is also really important because hitting a target in the head or the chest will do considerably more damage. And so if you can, you should always try and aim for these areas instead of the legs or the arms, making sure to allow for the fact that your weapon's barrel will rise as the recoil kicks in. If you do find yourself missing targets at mid to long range with automatic weapons though, you can use a technique called tap firing, which is where you repeatedly press the fire button instead of holding it in. And this will allow your weapon to come to rest in between bursts so that your shots actually land on target and don't fly over your enemy's head. But anyway, that just about wraps up this video, so hopefully these tips will help you to shoot guns effectively in BF5, and I'll see you on the battlefield.